Um, today we're doing small sketches and like watercolor paintings for this large mural that's going to be put in our cafeteria. Our goal is to create a mural that represents the community that Brookfield is in. What we wanted to do was to highlight the environment that we live in. And we're talking about the nature, not the cityscape. Each of my art classes are basically creating uh, different parts and different elements of this mural. And so we have students that are creating the insects that are indigenous to Ottawa. Same thing with flowers and plants and trees and bushes and all of those things. So right now we're just working on the cutouts of the like insects and small animals that are going to be put on top of the mural and like then photographed and blown up to create this wonderful piece of art. We have the artist Nicole Belanger who is working with us and guiding the students to create the maquette which is sort of like a, a mini version of a mural. We're making our, our objects out of paper, wool, out of found objects and we're going to create a landscape. And once the maquette is done Friday, I leave with the maquette. I have it photographed digitally. Then it's sent to a printer and he blows it up to the final size, which is 30 feet wide, 9 feet high, on a product called wallpaper. So it, it's going to create a super duper interesting mural because you're going to have all the layers, the depth and the shadows. Each table has different stuff. So we're doing like blades of grass, insects, small animals, trees, bushes, that kind of thing. I'm drawing a house sparrow because they're birds that you commonly see in this area. It's fun, it's it's creative. And then that's, that's the fun of it, right? Because we're all doing different parts of it and it just, it brings it all together and brings a sense of community of how everyone's different and we can all just bring it together into one. Because it's such a different way to do a mural, I'm hoping it'll stay in their minds versus the typical painted murals that we see everywhere. This is very, very different and I hope it gives them wings to explore different ideas to make murals.